So what I'm trying to do is uh, clean out the dirt. Um, the Devanagari is fully lost. Uh, so what I can do is clean the English part and, um, and find out where Devanagri should be restored. So what do I do? I take separate sentences, mark them as separate entities. So this will be like uh, like uh, Devanagri. This is the next Devanagri. And in this you see I shall abide by bow to you bow to your bow to your decision bow to your decision so we have decision okay so and in the text abide is in italics so it should be this in um, abandonment is also in italics abides by his promise abides by his promise but that actually not a separate line in after so let's keep them together so everything that should be Devanagari we can just kill and leave it say something like this make it make it stand out okay so so we know we should restore it later okay so to the best utmost of one's ability to the best utmost of one's ability as much as I can so the text is dirty 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 uh, but it's usually so after you OCR in Abbey um, but it's the best we can the best we have the best atmosphere so we delete these spaces which are not necessary to the best of one's ability to the best of one's ability Okay, so we should restore them. We should not care much about what kind of um, of them do we use. You see that these are one kind of and these are other kind. We should not care about that. Uh, that can be cleaned later. Uh, but if you can, you should better use something that is that is always the same. We don't have to figure it out later. We can just make it look like one. Okay, so we can add or remove adding uh, to see what's if there are any spacing or something's wrong. Okay, so all that one can do as far as possible. Possible the country abounds in curiosities. Okay. I remember right, it was curiosities. No, about okay. Uh, great. No. So this is what I want want you to do clean the text. So the text consists of choice expressions and idioms. Uh, there are quite so many of them. Quite some. Uh, then there are sentences for correction. I'm not quite sure but I can try. Let's see what Oliver software will do with them. Let me see. I'll generate this one. And then there is a glossary. 
Um, so the denigrate is lost, and what we'll have is text in two columns. So it's not a big one, it's still a very important one. And an English Sanskrit glossary. So we have most of the text translated into Russian. But we don't have these pages. We ha don't have the glossary. We don't ha don't have the the choice expressions. And this is where we need help. Okay. So then the, let's find the glossary. No glossary, gloss. Okay, glossary. Glossary. Um, so starting from here, we can make it in two columns. Otherwise, the text takes 80 pages, which is not what we would want to have. It should be around 45, and uh, no way 80. It sounds like it's a lot to do here, but it's not that much actually. So we can just OCR text, mixed text, so English words with Sanskrit and Devanagari. It's impossible to do right now. It sounds silly, crazy, whatever, but uh, you can do it. So you have to do you have to kill the one or the other. You can't have both. So you have to choose. It's no good. That's how things are. Okay, so I choose two columns. Okay, that should be this should be a bit better. Find the gloss, Sanskrit English. Gloss, make it big, like, uh, like, 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 whatever. Make it this gloss, sorry. Sanskrit English. So the common OCR er errors are here all around. Sun. Here comes the sun. So, just I don't get lost. What I'll do is make incom incomprehensible, not known. Incomprehensible. can do is one moment I can do is like this so I know when a new line starts okay being penniless being penniless yeah, a good word in the structure There's a quite a lot to do, so it's 45 pages. But it's an interesting reading, I guess, so it's up to. I loved this book for years. I bought it uh, 10 years ago in India. When I was there for the first time. The book is lovely. <laughs> so it should be enjoyable. Thanks for watching. Hear you soon. Bye.